we're learning more about the tragic impacts of the winter storm over the last week. The statewide death toll now up to 34 and the Knox County Regional Forensic Center is reporting eight winter weather related deaths in our area. The first happened last Tuesday when a box truck slid in the snow and rear ended a tractor trailer along I-75 near Callahan. As we've told you, the driver of the budget rental truck was pinned in the vehicle and was pronounced dead at the scene. Another deadly crash happened yesterday along Rutledge Pike. KPD believes the car hit a patch of ice, overcorrected, and went into the median before rolling over multiple times. Police tell us the driver was thrown from the vehicle and died at the scene. Medical examiners believe the six other deaths over the last week were caused at least in part by hypothermia. We're told three of those individuals were experiencing homelessness. Now, earlier today, a man was found dead outside the Edgewood Chapel AME Zion Church in East Knoxville. That's along Martin Luther King Jr. Boulevard. Knoxville police say officers arrived to the church around 730 this morning. The church's pastor apparently told officers he was jogging by when he saw the victim and called 911. The victim has been identified as a 73 year old man who had been staying up the street. KPD says there is no evidence of foul play. The body has been taken to the regional forensic center for an autopsy.